Chapter 1 You are listening at FameTV.info Please don't say that the surgery was very successful, because this was no longer a matter of surgery, it was some sort of magic. His face and body had all changed that he had become a completely different person, could it be that, he had transmigrated into a different dimension that I in addition to the mirror at the head of the bed that clearly had poor feng shui, sure you also found three books beside it that he picked them up to check them out, and the titles instantly made him fall silent, Beginner Tamer's Essential Monster Breeding Manual, Pet Nursing After Birth, Evaluation Guide for Beast, Ear Girls of Different Races, sure you. Dot. The names of the first two books were normal, but what was up with the last one? Cough, Sure Yu's gaze turned solemn as he reached out his hand. However, his arms suddenly stiffened, just as he was about to open the third book to see what it was about, he felt a sharp pain in his head as a large amount of memories flooded his mind, Icefield City.at the pet breeding base that an in turn pet breeder, beast tamer what was all this nonsense, this sudden memory took Sure Yu more than 10 minutes to digest after a long time. He raised his head with a complicated expression that he was right. He seemed to have really crossed into a different world not only because of these memories, but also because he knew that his looks would not fail him. As everyone knew, being ugly did not qualify one to cross into other dimensions. This was already a law of some sort somewhere and he had been so handsome, so of course, he must have transmigrated, after his accidental death. He must have transmigrated to this alternate world where beasts were mainstream. Although this room looked like a modern single dot person dormitory, he was no longer on Earth. Instead, he had come to a world called Blue Planet. This place was very strange, and the culture was completely different from that of Earth. Since ancient times, extraordinary powers had existed here, and they were not the battle aura, magic, and immortal cultivation that Shiryu sure you had seen in various movies. It was because every creature here had the possibility of extraordinary evolution through continuous evolution. Most animals and plants could awaken higher intelligence and powerful abilities that IT was not limited to plants and animals. Even mountains, lakes, and snowstorms could evolve into living beings, these transcendent creatures would all possess powerful abilities such as lightning, flames, and hurricanes. They were no different from the mythical beasts on earth. In this context, in the ancient times of this world, weak humans could only rely on powerful creatures as guardians to survive as tribes, however, after a long period of development, the human race gradually developed their own extraordinary power, the ability to control beasts. Some people could open up an alternate space in their minds through meditation and capture extraordinary creatures through this cage. Like alternate space that I in the beginning, Humans only captured weak transcendent creatures by force and treated them as slaves. They controlled them to work and fight, but in the face of powerful transcendent creatures, humans could still do little against them, however, later on, some people discovered that the growth speed of transcendent creatures in the beast, taming space was almost several times faster than in the outside world. It was also easier for them to break through the racial restrictions and evolve, this discovery allowed humans to see hope of rising to the top, and they began to study the beast, taming space, right after that, in terms of capturing, training, raising, and commanding. Humans continued to develop the abilities of their beasts and gradually perfected this system so that powerful battle pets of various types could be cultivated by humans. Their profession became known as beast tamer as they stepped onto the world stage, with the rise of beast tamers, many extraordinary creatures began to take the initiative to contract with humans, hoping to use the humans' extraordinary ability to grow quickly and try to break through the restrictions of their race that as of now, thousands of years later, humans had already established a shining beast. Taming civilization and controlled the area with the richest resources on this planet. I in this era of beasts, being a beast tamer naturally became a sign of status and class, all walks of life were closely related to beast tamers. Only by becoming a beast tamer could one become an elite among all fields. As an example, the appearance fee for a well. known beast tamer in a tournament could be staggering and off the charts, the presence of a powerful beast tamer in charge of the city alone could directly boost the economy of the city, beast tamers occupied the core positions in most industries, and the top positions were also held by beast tamers. However, although humans had risen up in the world, there were still a large number of beasts active in various places that could not be tamed, and they often caused disasters to human cities. 
This was also why some cities hoped to rope in powerful beast tamers to guard them and in his memories, the family of his previous self had died in a beast horde, the beast taming world. I have a rough understanding but why are things still so miserable for me after my transmigration? Sure you took a deep breath. So be it. However, in such a dangerous alternate world, it would have obviously been better to transmigrate into some second dot generation heir that IT would be best if he had a protective dragon dot girl type and the companionship of sprite since young. Only then would he not have transmigrated in vain, unfortunately, transmigration was just like reincarnation. It was a skill that he was still called Shiryu, but his identity was no longer that of mythology scholar Shiryu on earth. Instead, he was an ordinary intern pet breeder in the pet dot breeding base of Icefield City that he wasn't a beast tamer. He was more like a handyman for beast tamers, this was a place dedicated to raising pets, but he was currently only learning how to raise them here, his daily duty was to feed some pet cubs, shovel feces, and clean up that he was a proper worker at the bottom of society, however, in this way, sure you could start his path toward knowledge from just these books. So, he was studying. The reason why his predecessor in these new slash old memories worked so hard was that he hoped to become a beast tamer himself. But in reality, he was an orphan who couldn't even support himself, let alone train pets, with the original Shiryu's family background, it would be really difficult for him to become a beast tamer, however, Shiryu was also lucky in some ways. With a bit of talent and a bit of hard work, at least the current profession that he had was linked to being a beast tamer. It was not impossible for him to become a beast tamer in the future, he had even made a lot of preparations and had decided to buy high dot quality pet cubs using loans to become a beast tamer, yes, he had decided to take a loan for a pet at such a young age, Shiryu's defense line had been broken. It was indeed very tragic, the current Shiryu, who had a large debt from mortgage and car loans in his previous life, actually had a hundred million points of sympathy. He didn't expect that he would also have to take a loan after transmigrating, this should be in the distant future. At the moment, Shiryu was just a lowly worker, moreover, there would be tasks waiting for him in a while. He had a strict work schedule. To be honest, other than when he was in high school, he had not woken up at 6 in the morning for a long time, Shiryu rubbed his head in pain. Then, he walked to a wall and pasted a worksheet on it. This was the weekly task list that had just been issued yesterday. As an intern at the breeding base, his daily tasks were given out. Today's work was. Sure, you looked at the content below Monday morning. Feed the snow wolves, single task. Move the feed, group task, afternoon. Record the growth data of the green worm, collective task, hmm, if his memory served him right. Snow wolves were pack. Dwelling, ferocious, and brutal carnivores, right, for such a dangerous mission, was the solo tag for real, sure you fell into deep thought that he had been bitten by a dog when he was young and was naturally more wary of canines. This mission was a little difficult for him, but it shouldn't be a problem, sure you suddenly recalled that he had the talent of telepathy. He could communicate with any creature normally, and he felt that nothing would go wrong, he was able to come here for his internship not only because his academic results in the school's theory class were very good, but also because he had a special beast dot taming talent called psychic. When humans successfully opened up their beast taming space through meditation, they would also awaken a beast taming talent. Other than the fact that he had yet to contract with his first pet, sure you had. Successfully opened up the beast taming space and successfully awakened his talent, Fortunately, in order to cultivate those with beast dot taming talents, in the modern era, the country had incorporated the meditation method of opening up the beast dot taming space into compulsory education. Sure you was tested to have beast dot taming talents at that stage. There were many types of beast taming talents, but they were mainly divided into two types, the strengthening type and the special type. The awakening ratio was about 9 to 1 dot 4 beast tamers with such talents. For example, a fire dot strengthening talent, it was best to find pets with fire abilities to train. In battle, these beast tamers could use their beast taming talent to strengthen the power of their pet's fire skills, compared to the strengthening dot type talent, the special dot type talent was very complicated and irregular. 
There was a huge difference in the manifestation forms of different talents, for example, the special talent, share, could allow a beast tamer to receive a skill from their contracted pet and obtain a superpower. Generally, beast tamers who had this talent would be much stronger than ordinary beast tamers in terms of self.protection and combat strength, there was also the special talent, fusion, which could allow a beast tamer to temporarily merge with their pet to become a new form. Perhaps those beast.eared girls really existed.as for sure use psychic talent, while it was still a special talent, it was relatively common. It was one of the most common special talents, beast tamers with the gift of telepathy could communicate with any intelligent creature without language barriers after mastering their abilities, generally speaking, beast tamers could only understand the thoughts of the pet they had contracted with. However, beast tamers with the gift of telepathy could communicate with other people's pets and even wild creatures, for the development of the beast tamer profession, although the telepathy talent could not directly increase combat power, its status was unshakable and indispensable, after all, if they could communicate with other species, it was very likely that an unnecessary battle could be avoided, for example, in the field of beast tamers, medical workers, teachers, researchers, breeders, and so on, all the core positions were basically held by beast tamers with telepathy talents. It was a jack of all trades that he had such a practical beast taming talent. Logically speaking, it was easier for him to get along with wild creatures, at the thought of this, sure you heaved a sigh of relief, although he wasn't very proficient in using telepathy, it shouldn't be that bad that he subconsciously tried to use his beast taming talent to listen to the surroundings. He planned to familiarize himself with the steps in advance so that he would not fail later, but at this moment, something unexpected happened, as sure you's beast space vibrated in his mind, his vision suddenly blurred. Then, a black illustrated handbook made of stone appeared in his mind that he seemed to have, awakened his second beast taming talent. Dot. Listen to the full novel at fametv.info, direct link in the description.